Some big time college football taking place in Central Texas this week, and we also have a big one in the high school ranks as blood rivals Temple and Belton square off on Friday night. Temple quarterback Jared Wiley trying to leave his mark as a quarterback in T-Town before taking his talents to Austin to play tight end. More on that, here's Mandy Knight. Jared Wiley has college caliber talent at quarterback and tight end, a blessing and a curse to pursue one or the other in college. It was hard. Uh, you know, I'm really enjoying quarterback this year, but um, I think it's best for me if I play tight end in college, so that's what I'm sticking with. He's a really good tight end. I think, you know, I think Texas knows what they're doing with that stuff, but I'm going to tell you what, he's a pretty good quarterback too, so if they get in a situation where they need him to sling the ball around, he can do that too. Even though Wiley averaged 12.9 yards per catch last year, he chose to play quarterback his senior year. I wanted to do, you know, what's best for my team. You know, if they feel like they need me wherever, then that's where I'm going to play. Honestly, that that's a good thing because we do need him at quarterback. He has a great arm. He's able to run his routes. He can catch. So if we need him one week at another position, he'll play it. But I think him being quarterback is the best fit for us right now. The 6'6", 230-pound senior looked at the big picture and realized playing quarterback would only make him a better tight end at Texas. It helps me know, you know, what the defenses are doing before they do it based on their alignment. It helps my leadership a lot too. Uh, uh, you know, no matter what position I play, I feel like I can I can be a leader on the field. He can line up everybody on the field, so that's obviously going to help him. I mean, if he is running routes and he is doing stuff, he, he knows uh, what defenses look like. He knows how to read defenses. He knows what safeties are doing. He's a true student of the game, and I'm just real proud of how he's grown up. Temple's next game is on Friday at Wildcat Stadium, facing Belton in a big-time district matchup. Reporting for Fox 44 Sports, I'm Mandy Knight.